actually saw it in the numbers from the data that I collected. I've never done anything like that before. I've never been to a place where you can be learned so constantly. It's about a lot more than grades. Oh yeah. Right? Here, you, you actually come here to learn, not to get a certain percent on a test. Being able to live in what you are learning and being able to see what you're learning every day in real life all around you. My name is Chris Neufeld. I'm the Associate Director of Education at the Banfield Marine Sciences Center. Coastal Community Ecology is the course that I teach here in Banfield along with my co-instructor, Sam Starko. In Coastal Community Ecology, students explore patterns of biodiversity across a wide range of habitats um, in two kind of key ecosystems. So one is in the marine um, intertidal and subtidal, and the other one is in the terrestrial realm of looking at plants on islands. One of the main projects we've worked on in this course is we've taken a historical data set that was collected in Banfield um, about 30 years ago, and we've gone back and looked at how those patterns have changed over time. Students that take courses in Banfield in general, including this one, you know, they come in as quite well-trained junior scientists. They have a lot of theory, they have a lot of skills, they have a lot of background. Um, and what we try to do in this course is we, we give them a, a little bit of knowledge about a specific research project or series of projects that we're interested in, um, that, are, that are new projects, new information that, that we want to collect. And then the rest of the course students really focus in small groups on going out and collecting that real information about the world around us to try to figure out what's, what's happening in these environments. Students do this work largely through uh, field surveys and some combination of occasionally field experiments or some other kind of assays. They often have to change or design a new protocol to go out and do a new kind of sampling. And they often end up sampling in a wide range of, of habitats and regions around Barclay Sound. Students often end up in the Broken Group Islands where we have a number of permanent plots and, and all through the Deer Group Islands closer to Banfield Brain Science Center as well. One of the main things that students take away from this course is they really, they, they go from being consumers of knowledge to being producers of, of new knowledge.